Previously on Dust World. They're like spawn caping her. It's rolling 11d10. Oh my gosh! <laughs> 70 damage! 70! I just straight up annihilated her. You come running, you slide on your knees, like ninja style, and as you're spinning, your coat becomes a blade and just goes whoosh, and like literally slices right through her. Like a bunch of bugs sh oh shoot out the back and land on Clay. Oh! Who's behind? Oh! Yep. I'm gonna shoot this chick in the face. <laughs> At point, point blank, and I crit. She gon' die. You like shoot, like a big chunk of her face just like comes off, and it's just like insects running all over each other, and then they all like start feeding out of that giant hole, and also like the hole in her sides, and they go out of her body. Roll dodge, Wolfkin. Oh my gosh. Oh come on! It was so <laughs> <laughs> you see the damage? Yeah, I'm dead. Are you? What's your HP? 30 something. It's only 30? Yeah. Oh, flip. For a split second, you smell Griff. A blur shoots in front of you, and at the last second takes these shots for you. My response 62. to this? Now we follow our heroes. Gage Thane, a dust-casting, sword-wielding monk, from the mountains of Black Earth, Clarence Wales, the telepathic child runaway whose mind is strong enough to bring grown men to their knees, Kevin Wolfkin, the sharp-shooting, foul-mouthed, fox-faced hunter from a hidden village of war wolves. Let's see what becomes of them in Dust World. So Razzlus, like, started to bleed from the nose and uh, and he's, as he's trying to like walk over to the bar, he kind of stumbles. And he is now leaned over the bar, drinking whatever was left behind by some of the <laughs> bandits. What are you guys doing? Also, Wolfkin is kind of unconscious bleeding out. Turn order is not up. Uh, is that supposed to be there? Thank you. Oh, I'm up. Um, are the saloon girls still... Active. Mm -hmm. uh, Help me. <laughs> you are surrounded. I control Stuart. <laughs> I'm going to attack a saloon girl. Uh, I guess with a fist. Hmm. Okay. Can I strengthen and attack in the same turn, or does it does the strengthen become a turn in and of itself? You can probably strengthen and attack. Okay. I think she did, but I can do both. Mm -hmm. Um. No more questions. Yeah, I changed it now, so it's a D4 for every four levels. Stuart needs to be nerfed. <coughs> Nerf Stuart? I barely use it. <laughs> we barely, we've all been nerfed. It's okay. This is good. I'll strike them for you. Thank you. <laughs> okay. So he gets four for 12 rounds. Whatever, it's fine. All right, I um, guess I'm going to take on the saloon girl. Uh, this saloon girl, too. Ah. I don't know. Is that even wise, or should I? You guys you, don't you can have see, to right? attack these saloon girls, just so you know. We don't? They're not attacking us? I don't know. I feel kind of iffy about that plan, but... I mean... Zazzle flew out a hole right by where you're standing. Right yeah, by where I mean, I'm standing? Lovely. I mean, to be fair, if we don't have... I don't really want... I mean, so far, Stuart has not really come across as bad to them. If anything, it's been a protector, Zazzle. And i kind of like that to stay the same for as long as possible. Because if they find out that Stuart is... Against Zazzle, then they'll wonder who's Stuart, and they might trace that to me, and that would be bad because I have a health of eight. I'm assuming we're having a mental conversation as I am about to be beaten mercilessly. By oh, no, I mean, this is me. I mean, <laughs> I can put it uh, using the creepy voice. But, um, yes, those are all things I'd like to avoid. Well,. Do what Maybe. you feel best. I'm going to try not to be killed by women. <laughs> what did you guys decide? Uh, I mean... 
He's killing his lawyers, but she's like, I'm assuming this is all a mental thought as I'm about to be beaten by women. <laughs> oh, yeah, but it's imagine that happens. Surrounded. Imagine that, but instead of my weird voice, imagine it in Clarence's weird voice. I might just um, go and find Zazzle. <laughs> I mean, okay, so do you need a distraction with the barmaids while you're doing that? I mean... Just make a decision and my character will do what he feels is best. Well, I mean, that's how we got into this trouble to begin with. <laughs> well, that was your fault. You're the one who decided to shoot <laughs> I mean, shoot this is Zazzle. true. I mean, I don't know. I was going for covert. Are you guys talking mentally or are you meta right now? Uh, it's, it's, it's a mixture at this point. I was mixture. like... Thinking I'm it was using the mental, voice. but I then should he probably was talking use the voice. meta. Uh, like, the, the voice wise. Um, are they going up? Can you just. Well, your turn, told. Oh, is I've got a while. while. Yeah, I've got a while of beatings before I'm going to be leaving. Stuart has a lot of help. They're going to beat me with their pictures. <laughs> it's just not my favorite thing in the world, but I think I should. What take. is most of them aren't near you that get time. Which is, uh, so which Stuart is can't really. One. Number four. Mm. Oh, I thought it was number six. Mm. Oh, well, I can't get over there. <laughs> That's entirely your problem. I mean. She Hulk is going to oh, smash wait, my brain. Sorry, too. it's this one. Uh oh. <laughs> oh come on. No, that one I could get. Unless there's someone in the way. Yeah, uh, there's someone, but you can move right here and still get him. Where? There. And then slam. I'm going to mentally. Clarence, restrain She-Hulk, please! <laughs> yeah, you can do that. Do. Just do a grapple. Stuart doesn't like to fight, but... Grappling is not that much fun. Just hold this her down! Fault. She grapple? cracked the floorboard! Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> okay. I'll grapple. <laughs> so... Stuart will grapple. That's me. I'm practically begging you at this point. Mm -hmm. I watched her destroy a floorboard with one punch. I see. You're afraid of strong women. Interesting. I'm afraid of my ribs being cracked. <laughs> How much of a smart aleck? I don't think Clarence would know that. Um, Clarence is getting over his panic from earlier that made him do some rash and stupid decisions. Okay, so also her, her, <clears throat> well, her plus five rash. I prefer rash. Is, is being nerfed. Oh, it is? Yeah. Praise <laughs> everything that is good, including our DM because he nerfed her. <laughs> this is a uh, this is experimental DM DM deep <laughs> double D's <laughs> beta dark DMs. Ones ducking. <laughs> We're all right, dust worlds. all right, let's grapple. <laughs> let's grapple. <clears throat> so uh, just roll a D twenty. All right, so use like a miscellaneous or something. Do, 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 do. Wow. Oh! Pretty sure you caught her. <laughs> uh, let's see. Like RKO's are the ground. Stuart is on the case. <laughs> Excuse me, Stuart would like a word. <laughs> how? how? Oh, she's I'm not saying this aloud. So I guess she's say. extra slow. <laughs> she uh, She's totally grappled, bro. <laughs> Uh, Hold on, what's his plus four? And she's at plus four. Yeah. Not even. Yeah, yeah. She definitely is grappled. So, she's not damaged though, she's just restrained. Right. Okay. I'm totally okay with this. Uh, okay, I will continue to dwell in the corner, cowering, but also... I'm sitting there as I watch this happen, <laughs> breathing sighs of relief. Well, I keep my ribs. <laughs> <laughs> All's well that ends well. Clarence, we gotta talk about your one-liners in my head. They're getting a little weird. <laughs> and this is not ending well. You shouldn't have shot. You shouldn't have shot her. Jeez. Um, we got a creepy bug lady attacking us. Mistakes were made. <laughs> yes. Okay. Mistakes. Kevin's on the ground unconscious, and I'm surrounded by women, but not in a good way. I can't believe that mops that uh, <laughs> gunman shot her. That really threw a hook in our plans. Are you saying this out loud? Or no, know? mentally. <laughs> There's just like an awkward silence in the mental like logs, just like an awkward mental silence. It's Is that a joke? A joke? Wait, yeah. Clarence, you know how to joke? <laughs> yes. <laughs> you need to work on that too. Oh, uh, Barbie! <laughs> okay. Uh, well, all right. So, That's do you want to move somewhere, also, Clarence? 
I'm not really that interested in going after Swarm, the lady. Lady Swarm here. <laughs> lady Swarm. Hello, players. It's Paul Purnell, your purveyor of fun and exciting stories. You know, your GM. I could also be your second best friend if you want. Anyway, if you're interested in putting a shout out in the show or being a sponsor, please email us at business at paulparnell.com. We would love to hear your feedback on the show and the characters, and you can find all of our social links in the show notes below to connect with us. We also really appreciate you sharing the show with your friends. Every like and share and follow just really means so much to us. We just want to say thank you. Finally, let us know if you'd be interested in a Dust World beta that you could play with your friends. We really appreciate you playing along with us. Now let's see what happens. That's got to be a Metal Gear Solid villain. Probably so. Is it? <laughs> I, there is a, their one names called get, the Swarm. Their, name but, get, their names get really unique. Solid Metal Gear Snake, Solid owns Medi- Metal Gear. Metal Gear. Liquid Snake, Snake Punch Snake. <laughs> yeah. The boss. They're like snakes. <laughs> Okay. The swarm's one of them. Man. Number eight right. continues to put out fire. Number ten. Where's ten? Uh, she's all the way by the piano. Oh yeah. She uh she's by the continues to be the piano man. Do anything. Well, um, so twelve. <clears throat> she's on top of the piano actually. Yeah. Uh, that woman next to her is not doing anything. She's thinking, well, I just get paid here. All right, I'm getting paid for this. Okay, I don't care. <laughs> you do you guys, you do you. She uh, makes her way towards Laszlo. Laszlo. Um, let's oh, see, number dear. seven. Number seven is going to try and attack. Gage. Typical. <laughs> Full dodge gauge? I think I'll go for just a regular dodge to start. So I feel like I'd be more focused. You dodge. She tries to hit you with a pitcher. You move out of the way. Ladies, can, can I just buy you a drink? Like, let's call it a day. <laughs> Creepy lady's gone. I don't think I'm the only one who needs to Do I get You much? can't buy me a drink, darling, but I'll give you one upside the hand. You know, <laughs> mom always said the alcohol would go to my head. <laughs> Okay, number five is putting out the fire still. Again, Gage's I don't turn. think I'm the only one who needs to work on my jokes. <laughs> Shut up, Clarence. It's your turn, Gage. <laughs> Alright, so there's a hole by the wall right right next to me, correct? Yeah. There is a hole right here. So this is mentally to Clarence. Clarence, you got this right! <laughs> no. <laughs> Great, I'll talk to you in a few. I gotta go kill the bug lady. Oh. And oh, okay. I jumped out the hole in the wall. <laughs> Please kill the bug lady. Thank you. <clears throat> well, definitely don't go by yourself. <laughs> what? I don't want to take Clarence. Why? I don't want to go. I don't know. Because I feel like the barmaids might be the solution. I don't want to kill the women because they're always in mind control. So I don't want to continue fighting. Otherwise, I'm going to have to hurt someone. So okay. I'm thinking, well, okay, go get Everyone will spot. Okay. Okay. Um. That's my reason okay. for going outside is because I'm like, okay, these people are obviously under mind control, like Razlo, as I noticed. Wow, mm-hmm. my perception is really on point today. What? Wow, you guys both did. <clears throat> we're we're busy. Terrible. We're, we're, we're busy. distracted. I'm distracted by the ladies trying to hit me with alcoholic beverages. I'm distracted by my fear of insects. Let's see. I don't. I think I've already used my lucky roll too. I can't re-roll. Um. Okay. So. <clears throat> You do still hear Razlo like hacking and like blood is coming out of the bar, like where he's coughing, and he's like not looking good at all. Do we need to help Razlo? Clarence, we should probably kill the source before we try and kill any of these people. I'm not. Stuart doesn't want to hurt to them. Stuart's a pacifist. I'm not saying. I'll go with you though, because I don't care. Look, either you stay in here I do not and leave, I leave you alone with the I bugs, have made or you come decision. with me and we kill the bug lady. I have made a decision. I do not want to be in a bar full of barmaids and insects that want to kill me. Better to go against the one massive insects that could kill me very, very much. This is all terrible. Okay, and we're just going to pretend that we didn't notice Kevin on the ground. We're just going to run. Okay? Okay, I'm going to... <laughs> 
ease my way over there. You, you could use Stuart to grab him. You could put him inside of Stuart. Nah, we're fine. <laughs> Sorry, Loki. It wasn't my fault. All right, I'm expecting you to be right behind me. Jumps out the hole. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> okay. We're loyal. The barmaids like walk to the edge of the like where the hole is, and they just look out, but they don't go outside. They look like uh, they're stuck uh, somehow. Ha! My plan worked. <laughs> But what if that means that the actual controller is in the bar and there is a scope of influence? You know what? Don't burst my bubble. Let's, Let's just, just find go the bug lady the and kill her. <laughs> Razlo comes <laughs> falling out of the hole and lands nearby you guys. You doing okay? I'm most definitely not doing okay. Um, Clarence, is, what did you do to him? He looks I like he's like him. internally bleeding. I might help him again. Okay, um, so I can't psychically regenerate. So can, do you but have, maybe I don't even want to. Maybe so I just want to psych- turn, though. Yeah. Just out of curiosity, can I spot check coming outside to see if there's anything I notice or where the bug lady is or uh, anything promising at this point? So you saw her go into this bush right next to you. Okay. Like a whole cloud of bugs anyway. Please set it on fire. <laughs> <laughs> don't have fire, Clarence. I then we have a problem. I can't bend fire. I bend why dust. Didn't you There's get, a difference. Why didn't you get fire from... There was still fire. Dust I'm bender, not fire bender. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to go you ahead and open gotten? my canister and make my two blades. Dust blades. Okay. Um, do I need to roll for that? You do. Oh, Watching me, I'll roll a critical one. <laughs> I'm just like... The dust will Stab fall. yourself. The dust will just fall out of the canisters behind me. Well, uh, it's unfortunate. <laughs> <laughs> this almost never so happens. Where do, what do I need to roll for that, do you think? Uh, just a standard d20? No, dust abilities. Dust, <clears throat> oh. So... I don't have any quick bars for dust abilities. All I have is dust damage. Yeah, dust damage. Okay, I'll roll that then. Um, Do I need to insert levels for creating my blades? Because mm-hmm. I feel like that's a free use thing. Like, it's not you don't combat. have to spend stamina, but you still have to use a certain amount of dust skills. Well, yeah, no, I understand that. I'm asking more in terms of the fact of, like, is it something that counts towards free abilities or is it something that counts towards stamina? Yeah, free abilities. Free abilities? Okay. Your target number is 15. Oh, well, I was as many like D10s as you want, levels. you Good have gosh. your free uses. I think, didn't you use all of your free uses? That's what I was going to say. Is, are we, were we retconning that to where I used my stamina, or do we want to just go and assume the free uses was a one-time thing and switch to me using stamina for the rest of the battle since I've used them? Yeah. Okay. That's fine. I just wanted to clarify before I did anything like that. Okay. I'm going to use two levels. And wow. It's not was, too bad. No, that was terrible. My target was 15. Oh. I did not think that through. <laughs> Do you want to use another level? Yeah, maybe like three. <laughs> okay. Because I have... I used stamina, that was horrific. I did not think that through, so... Right, I saw... Let's, I thought it was two <coughs> D5s. That's let's, why I let's thought it was okay. And I used four instead of five. Instead of two, like an idiot. Okay. So that's four D10s of... Oh my gosh, watch it not. A lot of uh, so retroactive of all that was good. continuity right now. Oh, no, I'll do it. 18. Cool. Okay, thank goodness. So, so that was minus 4 stamina. And your swords were what, 1d6? Uh, yes, because I believe you said they were the same. Two of the same. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Actually, so they'll be 1d6 plus 1. 1d6 plus 1? Okay. Yeah. Well, that's fair. So I managed to successfully whip out my silk crate yep. wicked looking Two swords blade. come out. Look cool. Short swords. Alright. Ready? And go. Okay, so Razzlo's like coughing and he's like, uh, come closer. To me? To both of you. <clears throat> so I'm not really inclined to turn my back from the bush where I saw the bug lady go. Through. Agreed. I'll go over to him. I I'll <laughs> I'll show him. Clarence, check on the crazy bounty hunter that one-shotted our friend. 
Well, I want shotguns. I'm going to keep the bush. Okay. Don't feel like getting Um, ambushed. So, oh gosh! <laughs> Good image. Nice, nice. Um, okay, so down for the count. Oh my god! It's <laughs> gonna give me a mental slap. <laughs> <laughs> Again, for the umpteenth time, I don't think I'm the one who needs to. Okay. Anyway, so um, yeah, Raslo is like bleeding out of his nose and ears now, and obviously something is not right. What are you going to say or do to him? How much do I care? <laughs> Roll defense. <laughs> D20 for caring. Now, it's a matter of, I don't have psychic ability to regen. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, I can't really help anything, him. Right. So, it's a matter of, and I honestly don't care how if he survives. I mean, he was kind of terrifying and had a gun. I'd rather he be throwing that gun at the bush. Um. So, so you don't want to talk to him or anything? Like he, he might have intel, says the DM. Okay, you wanted me. You wanted someone. You wanted an ear. I'm here. Clarence, stop creeping him out and just ask what he needs. <laughs> what do you think I'm doing? <laughs> don't offer him a magic trick. <laughs> I'm not offering anybody a magic trick. Yet. Wow. No, not yet. Never. Just ask a question. He could use a magic trick. Um, well, what what do you need? <clears throat> if We're you on guys, a little bit of a time schedule here. If you guys are going after Zazzle, you should know she's... I'm pretty sure she's weak against fire. <coughs> also, <coughs> be careful because if she catches you, you could end up like me. You know what also has fire in it? Your bullets and your gun. Well, no, that's uh, Kevin's gun has fire bullets. <laughs> and we left him inside. And you left him behind. Well, I can't shoot a gun to save my life, so. Infinite Pixel is a proud member of Nerdsmith.org, a collaborative network for delivering nerdy entertainment, fan supported, and shared with all. If you would like to support Dust World or any of our other shows, you can go to Nerdsmith.org and click donate. Dust off your dice and hold on to your butt. Do you love magic, mystery, intrigue, and romance? Of course you do. Meet Rowan, the enigmatic bard. Atlas, the blacksmith, what a heart of gold. Kristoff, the sorcerer who enchants with both fact and fiction. Join our heroes as they unmake the best laid plans of their indomitable DM in The, the Lost Stupid. Stupid.